Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for January the 15th of 2021. Well, it is titled a plutonian landscape. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image of Pluto and this was taken back in July of 2015 when the New Horizons spacecraft flew close to Pluto and gave us our only close up images that we see of this dwarf planet. Now, when we look at the image here, we see a number of different features, including a number of more mountainous regions towards the left hand side. And to give an idea, those mountains are about 11,000 feet or two miles high. So very large mountains, especially for such a small object. And we see those here. So they're comparable to very large mountains here on Earth. Now we also see the uh, uh, plains off to the right hand side where you can see very flat regions that show very little signs of cratering or anything else. So these are lower lying areas and they have had all of the craters wiped out. So any craters that existed are now long since gone in those areas. Now this image was taken uh, just shortly before the the New Horizons spacecraft made its closest approach to Pluto. So it's one of the closer images that we have. And New Horizons has of course since headed further out into what we call the Kuiper Belt, or another area of objects um, much like Pluto, uh, Pluto being one of the larger objects in the Kuiper Belt, but a lot of other objects out there and then did flew by the object now known as Arakoth. Uh, about two years ago, it flew by there and gave us images of a second object out in the Kuiper Belt. So the problem with trying to study these from Earth is that even the largest ones like Pluto just look like big blobs. We can't see the detail studying them from Earth even with the most powerful telescopes. So it takes sending craft out there to be able to really see this. And there were a lot of surprises when we got to Pluto uh, five and a half years ago that a lot of the structures that we see here were not really what was expected. We knew that there were going to be some lighter and darker areas that could be seen from uh, like Hubble Space Telescope images. But the actual extent of the detail and the different types of terrain were quite different than astronomers had expected. And we still see these and are still studying these to really learn more about the objects in the Kuiper Belt. But at this point, we only have two of them that have any kind of detailed images that we are able to see and study and objects images like this from New Horizons around Pluto is one of those objects that we look at. So that was our picture of the day for January the 15th of 2021. It was titled a plutonian landscape. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.